as well out there in right field. And we've got an outstanding pitcher's duel, I think, tonight. Left-hander James Paxton coming in five and two, three fifty. Three guys reached. There's a ground ball in the hole. Tough play on Kike. He can't corral that one. These guys to throw out and throw the ball well and give themselves a team, the team a chance to stay pitch well and get a W. Sure. Three tables of scouts in the press lounge. They were also dining by Nissan. Nimble will lead things off his 15 home runs, followed by Cano Lindor. Hence the Red Sox starting pitcher. It's brought to you by Biotoyota.com. Paxton, one and one, lifetime again. Casas is at first. In the outfield, left to right, you got Yoshida, Duran, and Verdugo, and doing the. And Merzel is the umpire at third. We're taking on the New York Mets, who really tried to give away game one several times. and. First pitch to him in there for a strike, and we are underway. We know Pax going to give you 94 right there, but more often. Game one was a gigantic plate. 1-1. One, one. Socked into center field. Duran right there, barely had to move. On the liner, hauls it in. Here's Canna. Swing. Yoshida, in fact, coming in. Two up, two down. Nothing. Francisco Lindor takes a ball outside, 226 with 19 home runs. Occasions. That fastball still plays. Huh? I see 94 net. Fouled away. He gets in front. 95 mile an hour Swifty. One ball and two strikes. And a 1 2. Upstairs. Braves coming to town. Generally considered the 100. They've been amazing. Picked up by Alfaro behind the plate. And will flip on to get him. And for Paxton, that new sheet of Turner. Then Devers, Verdugo, and Casas. Hernandez playing second. He's had a phenomenal career. Max Scherzer will be 39 in five days, three times, one hit. 97 pitches against an outstanding one. Yeah, I know, you know, the first five games of the year, he came out with a. You see a lot of foul balls on it. You know, it's lost. It's 94, 95 into. To Duran. Jared at 315, five home runs, 18, three consecutive games, trying to snap that tonight. And he got a piece to hang in. As he pass, once you got two strikes on Duran, somebody was going to punch him out. There was a lot of swing and miss. One, two. Spoiled that one. That was 94. That's a game behind the Yankees who beat Kansas City 5-2 to two today. Yeah. One gone! Jeff. Number six. And this is a fantastic at bat by... Yeah, you see this little breaking ball. He goes to the curveball, down and in. That is a little lean there to make sure it got into the pole. Justin Turner now against Scherzer trying to hold up. They do appeal, and it's a swing and a miss. It's a couple of games. Didn't see the quality of bats we're accustomed to. It's four days up. Yeah, a couple of those home runs against Scherzer came in postseason play. Still big. You can still pull out this second game and stay within a couple. Yeah, in the wild card. Spoil that one. He's five and five in his career against Boston. 552. The looper toward right field. Can't it get over near the line? By out in the infield, Brett Beatty, he'll be at third base. Francisco Lindor is at two. Raffi with a pair of singles in the first game with one. Like a lot of veteran pitchers that we've watched over the course of this. Swing a high fly into right field. Thing around with it. Scherzer, quick pitching guys and holding the baseball. The big ticket pitcher for the Mets in there for a strike here on Verdugo. You're hearing well lately. Same thing with Max. Both these guys, no trade clause. Throw well, is there on the track to retire the side, but Duran gets a hold of one into the here at Fenway Park. Tom Werner joining us. Red Sox chairman, the founder of the home base program, a marvelous ceremony on the field. It never fails to be touching when, when we see it. And for us. I, I wanted to ask you, you know, from a personal standpoint, it means so, so important. Well, when the Red Sox came down to Washington after they won the World Series in 2000, take their lives by suicide every year, every day. So when you think about that, that's more than brilliant idea to leverage the healthcare system of MGH. It's clinical care. Recognized and, and honored throughout the day. So moving. Um, we see guys coming in regularly with 10 and 20 combat deployments, 5,000, all these places, and they don't ask for anything in return other than just 
take care of us when we get home. And, and that's really what those veterans do to allow us to come here and call a baseball game, play baseball. Fans walk. Yeah. I, I am so moved by the passion and the sacrifice. We, we remember that film, which is such a powerful film. Two down here for the New York goal in this, too. Well, you're right, Dave. And, and you know, 2,500 runners way of giving back. And, you know, Dustin Pedroia said something about this program. He said, Incredibly close to our $3 million goal of fundraising. We're at $2.93 million. Um, uh, slash 50-50, buy a raffle ticket, your chance to win, you know, half the proceeds. It's over. Realizing there's so much more that needs to be done for veterans and their families. And we joked this morning. million yeah, dollars it's for closer this. to this program through the run to home base. So incredible work happening. And thanks to. Yeah, a couple of those home runs against Scherzer came in postseason play. Still big. You could still pull out this second game and stay within a couple. Yeah, in the wild card. Spoil that one. He's five and five. In his career against Boston, 5.52. The looper toward right field. Can it get over near the line? By out in the infield, Brett Beatty, he'll be at third base. Francisco Lindor is at two. Raffi with a pair of singles in the first game, went one. Like a lot of veteran pitchers that we've watched over the course of this. Swing a high fly into right field. Around with it, Scherzer, quick pitching guys and holding the baseball. The big ticket pitcher for the Mets in there for a strike here on Verdugo. You're hearing well lately. Same thing with Max. Both these guys, no trade clause. Well, he is there on the track to retire the side, but Duran gets a hold of one into the here at Fenway Park. Tom Werner joining us, Red Sox chairman, the founder of the home base program. All marvelous ceremony on the field. It never fails to be touching when, when we see it. And for us. I, I wanted to ask you, you know, from a personal standpoint, it means so, so important. Well, when the Red Sox came down to Washington after they won the World Series in 2000, take their lives by suicide every year, every day. So when you think about that, that's more than. Brilliant idea to leverage the healthcare system of MGH. It's clinical care. It's recognized and, and honored throughout the day. So moving. Um, we see guys coming in regularly with 10 and 20 combat deployments, 5,000, all these places, and they don't ask for anything in return other than just take care of us when we get home. And, and that's really what those veterans do to allow us to come here and call a baseball game, play baseball. Fans want. Yeah. I, I am so moved by the passion and the sacrifice. We remember that film, which is such a powerful film. Two down here for the New York goal in this, too. Well, you're right, Dave. And, and you know, 2,500 runners way of giving back. And, you know, Dustin Pedroia said something about this program. He said, incredibly close to our $3 million goal of fundraising. We're at $2.93 million. Um, uh, slash 50 50 buy a raffle ticket your chance to win you know half the proceeds it's over realizing there's so much more that needs to be done for veterans and their families and we joked this morning million yeah, dollars it's for this. closer to this program through the run to home base so incredible work happening and thanks to 